<clears throat> I'm feeling much better. I really should have brought my inhaler with me. It was kind of stupid for me not to do that. Something to remember for next time. We've had to deal with rain lately. Now that we have a nice dry day, we can take care of a few things. There's still some alfalfa hay left, but our regular hay is completely gone. I had to buy that one bale of orchard grass hay from Wilco just to tide us over, but today we're going to go to a local farm and buy some more. I'll be able to show you how that cargo net works for the back of our truck. You are such a good dog. Yes, you're being a good dog. Good arrows. Sit. Stay. Stay. The reason we've been getting alfalfa hay and the regular stuff is our does have been a little bit picky about what they'll eat. They do, however, seem to like the hay from this local farm. You're a good dog. Yes, you're a good dog. They do, however, like the hay from this local farm. I've been feeding them a mix of the alfalfa and the regular hay lately. So, short story long, I'm going to get as much of the regular hay as I can today. Hey chickens, how you doing? I'm using all of the chicken egg money to buy hay for our goats. How do you ladies feel about that? You'll appreciate more hay, won't you? Yeah, I thought so. Wendy doesn't like being in these videos. She just had a birthday. I got her a cute hat for our dog that she wanted. Let's try it on for the camera. Yes. Yes. Oh. That is the sweet little puppy dog face. Yes. Eros, sit.
Eros, look at me. Sit. Eros, sit. Good dog. Yes. Yes, I know. There are squirrels out here. Let's get your hat back on. Come on. Show everybody at YouTube. Show everybody on YouTube how cute you are. Eros, look. Look at me. Not the squirrels. No. Who wants to look at some old squirrels? Come on. Yes, that is a good puppy dog. Oh, that's a good puppy dog. Where'd those squirrels go? Eros, where'd those squirrels go? You see them? Eros? You're a good dog. You're a good dog. What is it that Wendy calls you? She calls you a puppy bear? Here's a sweet photo. Wendy was away on a business trip for about a week. When we went to go pick her up at the airport, Eros just wouldn't leave her lap. Let's get the hashtag dashboard dog going. Does anybody else out there have a cute picture of their dog on the dashboard? As long as we're looking at dog photos, here's a couple more. Wendy thinks my feet smell bad. We may have independent confirmation of that. We really like the way that these solar powered motion sensor lights are working. So we got some more and we're gonna put those up. So we're here at the farm. I'm a little bit early, it looks like. I wanted to show you something. I've got something new for the dog. It's a leash, but it's springy. And it clips right into the seatbelt. That way the dog is safe. If the door is open and he tries to get out, he's not gonna hurt himself. He's not gonna get very far. Got to keep our puppy dog safe. Yes. Good dog.
We've got 18 bales in there this time. You'll have to forgive me, I'm a little out of breath. <clears throat> I'm actually allergic to hay. So being in the barn in an enclosed space kind of brings on my, my asthma a little bit. I'll be fine. We're not too far from home. This cargo net is one big bungee cord. So I feel better driving with this kind of a stack with that net on there. <coughs> I'm feeling much better. I really should have brought my inhaler with me. It was kind of stupid for me not to do that. Something to remember for next time. I realize I didn't really show how the cargo net hooks onto the truck bed. I've got a bunch of these detachable hooks. They just clip onto that bungee cord cargo net and then, and then, grab on just like that. If it's too loose, you can always just take these things and hook them farther up into the net so it pulls nice and tight. <laughs>